Hi everyone, this is Rendo Nadiandi and today I will answer a request from Rita Hertlendi. So let's make it in Canva. The first step is I will add this image. I use Instagram post portrait here and I will make it fit to page. And then I will download it first. Now go to apps and type photo and choose photo stylist. Click this icon. Click choose file. I will choose this one. The file that we just download. Open and click sketch and then create image. Okay, now we get the sketch effect image. What I like from this uh, photo stylist is the black and white result is the same position with the origin. Add a new page and then go to element and type folded paper, enter. And then just on the frame, I will choose this one and then copy it and paste on page 2 and then insert to the frame and then double click on it and click the size to fit the page and then done now we have a folded effect here and then copy this origin image and then paste here on page 2. Go to edit photo. And remove the background. Now click it once again. I will increase the size of the brush. And then erase here. Erase here. Here. Alright. And then click edit photo. Wait until it become a check mark. Okay, saving all change. And then go to edit photo again. And choose blur. And then click brush. Now let's brushing this edge. Okay, click edit photo, wait until it become a check mark. Now let's add a background, go to element, I will use this one, for hipster desk table, set as background. Now crop the image of the man. And then select the page and double click on it. I will slide it to the right a little. Done. Okay, and then select this all. I will slide to the right. And then select the color photo, duplicate. Go to edit photo. Go to the button. Custom. Change the highlight to totally black. Totally black mean zero. And the shadow also totally black. Okay. And then back. Wait until it become a check mark. Okay. Now go to blur again. Click whole image. At the intensity about 50. Enter. Okay. Edit photo, go to position, layers, place the blur image behind the origin, and then slide to the right a little, like this. You can see in this photo, the source of the light is come from this part. Okay, so the 
shadow will be on the opposite side. Now let's add another little effect. Go to element and then type shadow. And then see all on the graphic. Let's find the shadow like this one. Okay, and then reduce the size to fit with this paper size. And then go to position, center back. And then select this all and rotate a little to the right about three degree and place it here. You can increase the size a little. So now we have the effect that a sketch come to life. See you next video. Have fun with Canva.